What is up, guys? Cleaning PhD here, and today we're talking about the thing we all love, water-fed pole, man. Everybody's got to get a water-fed pole. These things are awesome. Some people hate on them, but they're great. Trust me. Get a water-fed pole. You're going to love it. In this video, we are going through a cleanup, a residential maintenance clean on this house here. And I want to talk about the importance of scrubbing the frames, scrubbing the frames of the windows, and the advantage that you get with water-fed pole where you're able to scrub the frames. Because if you're doing everything traditional, you don't want to waste the time scrubbing the frames. Screw that, you know? But with this, it's all part of the job. You get to throw the frames in. I'm not saying to not charge what you're worth. Definitely charge accordingly. But the clients are going to love it. And it's a wow factor. The clients love being able to get that curb repeal. The clients love being able to shine up their house, shine up their property because they care about their property. They're paying you $500 to clean their windows. They're paying you $300 to clean their windows, whatever. They care about their property. And so being able to scrub the frames, get the dirty, nasty stuff out of the tracks and all doing that with a brush and water is extremely advantageous. And the clients are going to notice that. The clients have been wowed by this water-fed pool. They're giving me recommendations out the wazoo. They're loving it. They're impressed. They're very impressed. Obviously, you've got to educate people. Some people freak out. They're like, whoa, what are you doing? But once they know the power of the water-fed pool, they will become believers just like I hope you will. So these windows here, you want to make sure to scrub the frames. These are highly oxidized windows. And you can kind of tell when you pull up on a job what kind of windows are going to be oxidized. These kind of casement windows are notorious suspects for being oxidized. And so you want to make sure that you're scrubbing the frames until the water runs clean because you can tell about the oxidation by how the water looks. It'll look milky. It'll look streaky. It won't look too good. You can tell that the color is coming off of the frames and it's bleeding into your water. So you want to scrub the frames basically until that all gets out of there. The second thing you want to pay attention to is the drip time. So if you're shooting that water into the frames, the water is going to get up in the nooks and crannies and it could easily drip down. So you want to make sure after you scrub the frames, like in this trio of windows that I'm doing right here, I start scrubbing the frames on the first one, then the second one, then the third one. And by the time I'm done scrubbing the frames on the third window, the first window has dried. So you want to pay attention to drip times with the water fed pole and there's a lot of like little details you need to learn over time, but drip time is especially important, especially with double hung windows. You want to make sure you're going across in a line and you're not just doing a double hung window where you do the top one and the bottom one. Like this one, I'm going across in a line. So I'm not clean. I'm not scrubbing the frames and then cleaning the glass. I'm scrubbing the frames on one, scrubbing the frames on the next, scrubbing the frames on the next, and then coming back and cleaning the glass. Next, cleaning the glass, next, cleaning the glass. So. You want to factor in drip time and you want to think very carefully because obviously you don't want to drive back. You don't want to have any complaints. And so the oxidization can be a very tricky thing when you're first starting out with water fed pool. But if you scrub the frames and you factor in drip time to everything and you allow, you know, maybe five minutes of drip time per window, you'll be looking good. So this is Cleaning PhD. I hope you guys have learned something about oxidized frames and I want you to drop me a like and a comment, and I want you to subscribe to this channel for more informative window cleaning videos just like this. Cleaning PhD, out.